Welcome, welcome, welcome everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm doing a little bit kind of messed up. Uh, Super Bowl, not Super Bowl, NFL tier list predictions. I have no clue why I did this now. I should have done this at the beginning of the season. But in my defense, doing it this at the beginning of the season is tough because I could or could not like, um, like I, I don't know. I just, I feel like getting aware of like how teams are is better than just doing it cold turkey because I would have put the Saints low. I would have put a lot of teams just low, you know, and I would have, I would have had, I thought teams done better or worse, you know? So yeah. Let's get straight into it. We're starting with the New Orleans Saints. They're looking good. I think they're going to be the team that goes to the NFC. Uh, I think they're going to go to the second round of the playoffs. I think they're a playoff team. I think they look good. I think Alvin Kamara looks back. I think uh, Carr looks good again. Uh, the offense looks flying. Uh, so, yeah. I think they look good. I think they look good. I think they're good enough to make the playoffs. I don't know if they're contenders or favorites because contenders, I feel like you have to have a little bit more juice. But I'm going to give them that doubt, the, 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 uh, the doubt of putting them at the playoff teams. Next up, we got the uh, Miami Dolphins. I'll put the Dolphins and Mason in the playoffs. They've lost to a See, at the beginning of the season, I would have put them at, at playoff teams. But they've lost to a Tua might be back next week, the week after. But Tyreek and Jalen Waddle don't look crazy. And I don't trust Skylar Thompson. He's not like a uh, he's a backup, obviously, but like dog, like how am I supposed to trust that nigga? Like, you know what I mean? But yeah, I digress. I think I got I got the Ravens and the Bengals. As a potential wild card. Uh, Ravens and Bengals. They both started the season off kind of shitty. I don't know who's going to go through. I think the Ravens are better than the Bengals. But. They've been unlucky. I can't put Ravens in the playoff. I think they might make the AFC championship this year. But who knows. Like really. like Because they've been playing. You know. Mm, uh, uh, I won't put this at. I'm not, I'm not saying they're mediocre. I think they're going to be young but intriguing. Mediocre would be they'd go middle of the park, maybe even low, but below 500. I don't believe that. I think the the Broncos suck ass. Uh, They suck fucking ass cheeks. But they're not as worse as the Giants. The Giants fucking suck. Holy shit. Only saving grace there is Malik Neighbors. He does look good. I've seen him play. Uh, he did drop. I think he dropped one pass at the end of the se uh, the end of the game. I don't know what he did, but he fucked up. Uh, I like the response that he had. Um, I don't know. I I don't believe in the Broncos at all, and I think the Giants are ass. I think the Vikings are a playoff team. They look good. Sam Darnold looks fucking amazing. I think the weight of being oh I'm gonna be the number two anyway. Oh no, but now you are the number one when JJ McCarthy got injured and he didn't have anybody. Like fucking growling in the back of his neck, like I want to take over. I want to take over. It's really hard to play well when you know somebody's about to take your spot. Like it's really hard. But yeah, I think we're a playoff team. I think we're gonna we're gonna go all the way. Rams. I think mediocre at best. They look middle of the park. Puka Nakua is out. They still have Cougar Cup. They still have uh, Matthew Stafford. So I'm not running them out. They might be a potential wild card. Missing the playoffs, but I'm going to go mediocre at best. I think these guys are up there. I think these guys are up there. I think uh, Buccaneers are also a potential wild card. They don't look bad at all. I think the problem with the Bucks is uh, there's too much con like, too much uh, people in the NFC that they, they might not make the wild card. Uh, actually, AFC is like that too. So I feel like they'll be teetering on this. They just have to continue to play well. But I'm going to put them at wild card. I, I believe in them. Lines. I think uh well, hold on, I clicked the Bears, the Lions. I would say potential wild cards for the Lions, but it's like, bro, I don't believe in these niggas at all. Like, I don't think they're anywhere close to what they were last year, and I feel like they're gonna they're gonna miss the playoffs this year. But I'm not gonna rule them all the way out. I'll put them at the potential wild card slot. I put the Bears, young but intriguing. Caleb Williams has not looked good, but I don't expect him to. I don't know why rookie QBs are starting. I really don't know. You're supposed to learn the program, learn how to do shit. 
before you become a starting quarterback. You're just throwing this guy into the fire and sees it, sees it, see if he sinks or swims. And that's never a good idea. I think he was the number one pick for a reason. So give him some time. Give him some time. I don't know why, but yeah. 49ers are Super Bowl contenders. I don't know why anybody always doubts them at the end of the year uh, or at the beginning of the year. They act like these guys are not going to do anything. They're Super Bowl contenders. They're really, really good. I think they're even better than a lot of other players. Uh, a lot of other teams, like, I think they might be the second best team in the fucking, uh, in the NFL. I think the Chiefs are obviously number one. I think 49ers have been up there for a lot of years. I don't know if this year is the year they'll do it. Obviously, I'm rooting for the Vikings, but, yeah, uh, you can't really doubt them at all. Next up, we got the Eagles. I think the Eagles are going to be a playoff team. I feel like everybody forgets who the Eagles are every week. Oh, they lost to the Falcons. Oh, they're this or they're that. Oh, they beat the freaking fucking the Packers. That's not a big deal. Oh, like, they have so many weapons. Jalen Hurts is a good quarterback. Then look at who they got out. They got Devontae Smith, A.J. Brown. Then they got Saquon Barkley. I don't know, like, how, like, people are doubting these guys. They have two elite wide receivers and a great running back. It's going to be really hard to stop this team. I got them in the playoffs. Raiders, I got them missing the playoffs. I think they might be a potential wild card for a little bit, but I think they're, I think they're up here. I think uh, missing playoffs or mediocre at best. That's where I'm going to. But I'm gonna put missing playoffs. I think uh, Packers are gonna be mediocre. I think the Commanders are gonna be mediocre. I think the Cardinals are gonna miss the playoffs. Uh, I don't want to put them as potential wild cards because I don't really believe they are. But yeah, Steelers, I think they're going to make the playoffs this year. They look good. Um, I think they're going to be top of the division. I really do. Every year, they always doubt on the Steelers. Every year. Where does that get them? It gets them absolutely nowhere. Fucking nowhere, man. Uh, Bills, the Super Bowl contenders. Come on, dog. Like, that's so easy to me. I think that um, the Bills are the second best team in the AFC. The real Josh Allen is the ooh, Josh Allen's really good. Josh Allen's a really, really good quarterback. Uh Falcons started the season off a little rocky. I love Kirk Cousins, obviously. I don't believe in them as much as I would like to. I gotta put the Falcons potential wild card. Cause I don't know if they'll make the playoffs. Seahawks, I'll say they missed the playoffs this year. I'll say the Patriots young and intriguing. Next year we'll see what they're up to. I'll say the Browns are gonna be mediocre at best. I'll say the Texans are a playoff team. The uh, Chiefs are definitely a Super Bowl favorite. I, like, how, like, I feel like every year at the beginning of the year, they act like Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs are just not a good team to hype that nigga up for some reason. I really don't understand why. Like, in my mind, they're doing it on purpose. Like, on God, there's no way that you think that, you know? You know what I mean? It, it, it really, like, it pisses me off to no end. Like, there's no way you don't believe that Patrick Mahomes is going to win this year. Like, why are you trying to put battery in his pack by acting like he's not the best player in the world right now? Like, ah, man. Cowboys. I got the Cowboys missing the playoffs. They look ass. Hopefully, they continue to be ass. I actually hope. I don't really care, to be honest with you. A lot of people hate the Cowboys. I'm not one of them. I'll be honest. I really don't give a fuck about them. I, I, think, I think they're going to miss the playoffs, though. I think they're... I think they're just not going to do well this year. That's pretty much all I have to say about them. I think the Chargers and the Jets are playoff teams. Uh, I think they're going to be really, really good. Hold on, let me count AFC real quick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven. Should be seven. This guy's going to have a bye, so it's one, two, three, four, five, and then one of these guys. Yeah, then I have one, two, three, four. I need to have two more in the NFC, but I don't believe any of these guys are going to make it, to be honest with you. I put the Bucks as a playoff team. Carolina Panthers, ooh, terrible season. I think uh, Jaguars are going to be mediocre at best. So are the Titans and the Colts. Oh, actually, I put the Colts, young but intriguing. I think they have it. Um... Hold on a second. I'm going to have to put the Falcons and the Lions up, I think. And I'll put, the, put these two up there. Yeah. Let me count real quick. We have the Niners, the Saints, the Eagles, 
the Vikings. That's four NFC teams. That's five, six, seven NFC teams. And then we have one, two, three, four, five, six NFC, uh, AFC teams. Wait, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six NFC teams. Oh, I think I need seven for each side, right? Yeah, I think I need seven for each side. Put the I'm put the Ravens here. Let's let's split this shit up too. I'm gonna put them in order as well. I'm gonna put KC and the Niners up there, and then contenders. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put the Vikings and the Bills as the AFC championships, and then third place I'll put the Saints. Then the uh, put the Saints, then the Eagles, then the Lions, then the Bucks. I put the Bucks ahead of the Lions, and then the Falcons. Then I put I put I put Texans, Texans, Ravens, Steelers. Oh, actually, Jets, Texans, Ravens, Steelers, Chargers. There you go. That's in order now. And that's it. That's all I got for y'all. Hopefully, I'm right. If I'm wrong. Who gives a fuck? Thank you guys for watching. Uh, appreciate the love on all the videos recently. Keep liking the videos. Keep watching. Keep subscribing. Really motivates me to continue on. Um, a little bit of low effort. I'll try to make some better video guys, uh, better videos for you guys. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, like the video if you like the video. Comment if you comment. Whatever the hell you want to comment. Share this video with your friends, family, any concerned citizens. Subscribe to the channel. It really helps. And hit that notification bell. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out.